hey friends welcome to my channel again in today video i'm gonna show you how to install docker on kali linux in few minutes on windows 11. are you new to my channel don't worry just subscribe comment and like and stay to the video until the end there's a lot of tips and tricks how to install docker on Kali Linux. So stay tuned and let's get started now. Okay, now the question, what is with docker? Docker is an open source platform for building, deploying and managing containers application. It actually enable developer to package application into container, standardize executable component, combining application source code with the operating system library and dependency required to run that code in any environment. Container, on the other hand, simplify delivery of distributed application and have become increasingly popular as organizations shift to cloud native development and hybrid multi-cloud environment. So basically developer can create container without docker but the platform make it easier, simpler and safer to build, deploy and manage containers. Docker is essentially a toolkit that enables developer to build, deploy, run, update and stop containers using simple command and work saving automation through a simple API. So now, what about Kali? What's Kali Linux? Kali Linux is an advanced penetration testing Linux distribution used for penetration testing, ethical hacking, network security assessment and many more Kali Linux is pre-installed with over 600 penetration testing programs including Nmap, Wireshark, John the Reaper, Aircrack, Bob Sweet and Oyap Zap you name it but in this video we're gonna stick only for how to install Docker in Kali Linux Well, this is a basic requirement you need to have in order to install Docker on Kali Linux. You need to have a Windows OS 10 or 11. You need to have a virtual box installed with a 2 or 3 CPU. You need to have the Kali Linux OS installed and you need to download the actual Docker from the Docker website. Okay, now you can launch your virtual machine and uh, you see the Kali Linux on it. Just fire up. It's gonna fire up from the virtual box. So once you're in it, just keep it up using it and uh, use your username and password as below. Then the first command you're gonna use it will be sudo app install y docker so this is gonna install docker on your Kali Linux straight away so just follow what I'm gonna put in the screen With few commands, the installation is gonna be wow. So just follow up 
and uh, make sure you really put the command as the way I put it on the screen so if you mix something or you miss someone something on it it's gonna really uh, give you an error message so watch carefully and uh, follow up well this command let you check and enable the docker on your machine straight away so keep an eye on it as admin of the system you can create your group to use docker on kali linux so by using this command here but it depends if you need it Not to ensure that your installation went fine so use this command it's gonna direct you to the web page of uh, DWA to check out if everything's gone as expected so put the command exactly the way it is and then put the IP address for your local host to see what's going on So right here just put your username and password it's gonna take you to the page and there check out until the bottom you see the option to create a database it's gonna reject at first because uh, this is the way they, they, they make it set up so re enter again by using the same uh, username and password which is admin and password to let you to the uh, uh, web page again so once you enter there this time it's gonna work so it's basically try to refresh the page but uh, kicking you out so if you click now it's gonna let you in and if you check down you'll notice that you got the option to create your database that was the end if you did like the video please don't forget to subscribe to like and comment i'll go so many more videos to come so stay tuned and uh, i'm sure you're gonna like those on coming so basically mostly it's gonna be for all new technology all new trend cyber security windows 11 and you name it so enjoy it and uh, have fun